My very sweet husband got us tickets to see a Melissa Etheridge concert, and she was unbelievable. And we were really blessed to meet Melissa Etheridge prior to the show. And whenever I meet a celebrity, whenever I meet someone that's important, I always ask them, how do you stay healthy on the road? What do you do to stay healthy? And it's really interesting the answers I've gotten from the different people, the different rock stars, the different um, movie stars, the different people that I've met over time and how they tell me how they stay healthy. But one of the things that Melissa Etheridge told me, well, actually a few of them I'm going to tell you about, which are the things that I tell my patients all the time. And these are the things that when I meet the other celebs and I, when I meet the other movie stars and when I meet the other rock stars, I always talk to them about this stuff. And everybody wants to sit down and bend your ear and talk to you about these really cool things. And this was a really great experience I had with her. I said, hey, Melissa, how do you you stay healthy when you're on the road? What are you doing? Because for those of you out there who don't know who Melissa Etheridge is, she's a really great rock star and she is a really great person. And she's a 17 year cancer survivor. And, the, you know, health is important. And especially for someone who sings, what happens if you lose your voice? You, you lose your, your career. And so, you know, she said, hmm. I don't think anyone's ever asked me that before. This is interesting. And I looked at her and I smiled. And in my head, I'm thinking, okay, sleep, eat quality food, make sure you drink your water, you know, reduce your stress. And she looks at me, she goes, well, I make sure I get plenty of sleep and I'm giggling inside. And um, I try to really drink enough water. And then she said, makes a smoothie every morning, which is kind of interesting because when I um, met with, um, when I met Martha Stewart, one of the things she does is garden every day and she makes smoothies and things like that. And that's kind of cool. Um, I know when I met Johnny Resnick, who is um, the lead singer, Johnny Resnick is the lead singer for the Goo Goo Dolls. And I know when I met him, he was pretty interesting to talk to too. And he's a huge believer in functional medicine and the functional approach to health and taking things as, as um, um, nutritionally as we can, as alternative as we can, as healthy, take that healthy approach. He told me when he goes to different towns, he takes off right away, tries to find a Whole Foods or a Sprouts or a organic place where he can go get some healthy food and bring it to his hotel room so that he knows that he's got some good choices because there's not always really great choices. So that was kind of cool. Um, but yeah, when I met her, she said, yeah, I try to sleep enough. I try to get enough water. I make these smoothies. And then she looked at me and we were talking about alkalinity and one of the other mixtures that she made and drinks every single day. And then she looked at me and she goes, you know, what are the other big things is stress? And I looked at her and I giggled and I said, oh my gosh, I know that's why we hire all these people to take our stress away from us. And she and I were almost on the floor laughing about that. She's like, me too, that's what I did. I hire people so they can take the stretch. So my stretch is this big and their stress is, you know, each one of them, because there's 17 other ones is this big too. So instead of her having all of that stress or me having all of that stress. And, you know, I thought that was really cool cool listening to her talk about stress and health because I tell my patients this all the time, stress and sugar, processed sugars, not good fruit sugar, but processed sugars, uh, stress are the greatest sabotages of your health that there is. And when I talked to her about that, um, she was laughing too. She said, you know, I never really thought about it. And then the fun part was when we were at the show and she started talking about, you know, make sure you sleep, make sure you drink your water. And she looked at me because she, she and I had just had that conversation and it was kind of cool. So, you know, I tell my patients that all the time, make sure that you're drinking enough water, getting enough sleep, working on gut, reducing your inflammation, which is the stuff that I can help you with. Make good choices when you can. The 80-20 rule always applies when it comes to this. Make sure that 80% of the time you're eating healthy, the other 20% of the time, ah, your body can handle it. You're good. And keep your stress levels however that is for you. For me, it's taking a walk. It's going to hot yoga is my favorite. Working out, um, sometimes dancing. These are the de-stressors. For me, I love to go to a movie. I love to go to a concert. We had front row seats, by the way. Thanks, Melissa. It was a great concert. Concert. And hopefully this is really good and fun and informational for all of you out there listening because it's the same stuff I talk about. You know, it's sleep, it's stress, it's water, it's eating healthy so that you can live a longer, more optimal life. And, you know, hearing it from all of these other people, even, you know, I talked to Bon Jovi about it. I, I talked to um, Pat Mon 
hand about it. Um, I've talked to uh, so many different people about it. It's pretty fun, you know, when you hear these and then they get it. And I think um, even this year, more and more people are really starting to get that without your health, you have nothing. Health is wealth and it really, really is. So I hope that helps you too. You know what? We're getting to the end of our time together. So if you would like to email me, you can email me at feelbetter at lakepointwellnesscenter.com. You can go to my website at feelbetterhere.com or you can give me a call at 770-974-5215. We can have a good old fashioned conversation. Until next time, wishing you loads and loads of health and happiness. Bye-bye. Thank you.